What was that? FCS caution. Stop or go? Go. Warning rescinded. In the B-2, there's two different kind of caution lights, the red one and a yellow one. In this case, it was yellow, which is just precautionary. A red caution light, you probably abort the takeoff. 145, rotate. Spirit of Kansas lifts off the runway at Guam. Almost immediately, the massive bomber pitches up dramatically. Next thing they know, they're going straight up. The momentum of that maneuver up caused their pilots to experience about 1.6 Gs. The aircraft's no longer doing what it's supposed to be doing. Full power. The B-2 isn't gaining altitude. It's still only 80 feet off the ground and losing speed. Make believe you're in your automobile right now. You turn left, but the car turns right. What is going on? That's not the way it's supposed to work. That's the scenario these pilots were in. The pilots now feel their airplane shaking violently and realize it's on the verge of stalling. From my 15 years of flying the B-2, uh, the only time I felt the B-2 shake is in the simulator. That's the only scenario where you will feel that shake. You never feel it otherwise. The plane's left wing drops. Grieve knows the plane is heading for the ground. There's only one thing he can do to save his and Major Link's life. 